Hey everybody, uh, welcome to Poetic Philosophy number 9, Poetry by the Lake. In today's podcast, you will hear Shall the Dead Praise Thee by George MacDonald. Thoughts by Abram Joseph Ryan. And I'll end it with I'll Tell You How the Sun Rose by Emily Dickinson. All these poems are in the public domain and I hope you check them out and more because poetry is life. Thank you. What is poetry? This is by the Poetry Wiki. Poetry is a form of literature that uses aesthetic and often rhythmic qualities of language, such as phonesthetics, sound symbolism, and meter to evoke meanings. Poetry has a long history. And of course I say, that is why poetry is life. It's been with us from the beginning of time and even before the beginning of time. This poem is from Public Domain Poems. It's entitled, Shall the Dead Praise Thee? by George MacDonald. I cannot praise thee by his instrument, the master silts and moves nor foot nor hand, for see the organ pipes this, that way bent leaning overthrown like wheat stalks tempest fanned. I well could praise thee for a flower, a dove, but not for life that is not life in me, not for a being that is less than love, a barren shoal half lifted from the sea. Unto a land where no wind bloweth ships, the wind one day will blow me to my own. Rather I kiss no more their loving lips than carry them a heart so poor and prone. I bless thee, Father, thou art what thou art, that thou dost know thyself what thou dost know, a perfect, simple, tender, rhythmic heart, beating its blood to all its bounteous flow. And I can bless thee, too, for every smart, for every disappointment, ache, and fear, for every hook thou fixest in my heart, for every burning cord that draws me near. But pray these wake, not song. Thyself I crave, come thou, or all thy gifts away I fling. Thou silent, I am but an empty grave. Think to me, Father, and I am King. My organ pipes will stand up awake. Their lift soar as from smoldering wood the blaze, and shift contending harmony shall shake. Thy windows with a storm of jubilant praise. This quote is by the great Yankee poet, Robert Frost. Poetry is when an emotion has found its thought and the thought has found its words. It's from the great poet, Robert Frost. This poem is from Public Domain Poems. It's entitled, Thoughts by Abram Joseph Ryan By sound of name and touch of hand, Thou ears that hear and eyes that see, We know each other in this land, How little must that knowledge be. How souls are all the time alone, No spirit can another reach. They hide away in realms unknown, like waves that never touch a beach. 
We never know each other here. No soul can another see. To know we need a light as clear as that which fills eternity. For here we walk by human light, but there the light of God is ours. Each day on earth is but a night. Heaven alone hath clear faced ours. I call you thus, you call me thus. Our mortal is the very bar that parts forever each of us as skies on high part star from star. A name is nothing but a name for that which else would nameless be until our souls in rapture claim full knowledge and eternity. This quote is by Michael T. Coe. Life is a series of events strung together like a phrase of a sentence, forever changing and forever adapting. Turn the page and read on. That quote is by Michael T. Coe. This poem is in the public domain. It's by Emily Dickinson, and it's entitled, I'll Tell You How the Sun Rose. I'll tell you how the sun rose, a ribbon at a time. The steeple swum in amethyst. The news like squirrels ran. The hills untied their bonnets. The bobolinks begun. Then I said softly to myself, that must have been the sun. But how he set, I know not. There seemed a purple style that little yellow boys and girls were climbing all the while. Till when they reached the other side, a dominie in gray put gently up the evening bars and led the flock away. Medicine, law, business, engineering, these are noble pursuits and necessary to sustain life. But poetry, beauty, romance, love, these are what we stay alive for.